Hello, welcome to Design. In today's video, I'll show you how to create the color wheel with the HSB model in CorelDRAW. So open your CorelDRAW. So let's create a new document. Okay, so when you create a new document, I just pick a cycle, the ellipse to hold on the control key to make a perfect cycle. And um, we're going to just use um, a rectangle and just create a line around it. Okay, so align this to the center by pressing the letter P. I can also select, marquee select the both circle and the rectangle, press the letter E and C to centralize it both the top and the bottom. So the next thing we are going to do is to call up the transform docker. So you go to your window, dockers, okay, look out for transform, okay. So that's how you get to it. I already have it, so this uh, a shortcut for it is alternate, alternate F7, alternate plus uh, the function key seven, okay. So when you do that, you're going to have this up. All right, so what we want to do is to divide this circle into 12 different places. So we're gonna take an angle of 30 degrees and the number of copies I want it to apply is 12. So just click on apply. So you make a marquee selection and on the property bar, you click on the simplify, make a marquee selection on the property bar, click on simplify then you can delete these rectangles. Just delete the rectangles and there you have it. Uh, just create another circle in the middle. Select both objects, align them. I'll uh, just reduce this a bit. Select both objects and also trim. So this time I'll delete this circle. Now you can see this is all welded together. So you just break it apart, right? Click on it, select break apart. So we can start choosing our colors. So I can just start from, let's use the smart field tool. Okay, using the smart field tool, I'm going to use the HSB model color to make this feeling. So I'll take it to the beginning so the first color we have here is this red so i'm going to fill that in go back there and um, you add a 30 to it add 30 you fill in the next one so you just continue this add another 30 and 60 so you just do this to the end and then we are going to have all of it fixed up. So 60 and 30 is 90. The next one 90 plus 30 is 120. Here the next one. And uh, we have uh, 120, 120 plus 30, we have, uh, so I'll just speed this up so we So this is what we have. This is our color wheel with the HSD color model. So if you find if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Comment below if you have any question or suggestion for future videos. Subscribe so you get notified when the next Apple video is out. Feel free to share this video with your friends. 
I know this will be very helpful to them. Thank you very much for watching and see you in my next video. Bye for now.